right, welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us on NL West matchup on the show. It's the Los Angeles Dodgers and the San Diego Padres. First pitch coming your way next. And a pitch. Swing and a ball popped up. Vivas settles under this one and puts the squeeze on that. One down. High in the air, out to right. Betts go, drifts towards it and makes the grab. Two away now. Fernando Tatis Jr. to hit here. Comes into this one with the seventh best batting average in the NL. Hey, got two here. Swing and a ball lifted in the air, left field, pretty well struck. That's back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. Nada for the Padres in the opening frame. We'll go to the second in San Diego. No score on the show. It. He isn't really known as the starting pitcher that's going to get you deep into the start. It's not that he's not capable. He just hasn't proven that he can do it yet. It's most likely early in the game because as he gets settled in and gets deeper, it's almost like he gets stronger. The 3-2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. You've seen him make that transition a lot faster. The 1-2. Swing and a miss, and he got him. And there's one down. Well, it can be so tough as a hitter to pull yourself out of an extended slump, one that lasts for several games, even a week or more. No, right now, he's really in one, so I'm sure his mind is all over the place. Swing, and that ball smashed on a line. And that should be extra bases. Here comes Machado around third. The relay throw, not in time, he's safe. And a run comes in to score. And that is his 1,000th major league hit. A nice moment for him. Third, one, one down, gone. Down. And a swing and a miss. Two out. Typically that high fastball, if it's close to the top of the strike zone, a hitter, if he's prepared for it, can get to it. But that one just had that little jump at the end, which indicates there's a good spin rate on it. Line drive. Makes the grab, and that'll end the inning. So a run on one hit. No errors and a man left. We head on now to the top of the third. It's the Padres one and the Dodgers nothing. And the right-hander deals. Smash to the left side. And that's a base hit. So a runner aboard to start the inning. That pitch up and in. Want to try to tie him up. That's the one thing we're seeing. That high fastball, you have to get it up there because of how hitters have changed their swings. Man, that slider bearing in on your hands like that. It's just so tough to fight off. It's kind of like a cutter and just can eat you up, saw you off. I'll tell you what, hitters have nightmares about that pitch. Ohapi stands at first with one out. And that one is lifted in the air. Marsh, he ranges to his right. And there's two away. And Tatis Jr. continues to be one of the most dynamic talents in the game. That season he put together in 2021, one of the best in Padres history. And they take care of Tatis for the out. And that is that. One left for San Diego, but they still lead it 1-0. The designated hitter, Manny. The pitch. In the air, right field. One up, one down. Swag and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Two outs. Swag and a miss. Struck him out. And the inning is over. On to the top of the fifth we go. All tied 1-1. Plays it one here. Left hand hitter waits. Got him. And he's down on strikes for the second time today. Not the best location with the fastball on strike three, but when you're pumping high 90s, you'll get away with some of those. More margin for error. You know, the fastball has become such a huge strikeout pitch in the sport. Strike. 
Kicks and fires. In the air out to center. Marsh under it. I got it. I got it. And there's two down. The punch out there picks up strikeout number seven. Nothing doing there for the Friars. Score remains tied 1-1. Check this guy out. Let's go. And a pitch. In the air, right side. Betts settles underneath it. I got it. I got it. And out number one on the grab. Lifted in the air, out to left. And he pulls up on it, and that's a hit. Too much. You got to make sure that you feel the ball cleanly and get one out first. It's going to be tough to get two with this kind of speed in the batter's box. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. That's out number two. Oh, that slider down and away. It's just kind of a slow death. With two strikes, you're looking to protect. And halfway to the plate, you know you've committed. And you know you're going to have no chance of touching it. Chato. Good speed on the base pass. He handles the bat very well. I wouldn't be surprised if the skipper puts on some type of hit and run or run and hit. Freeman steps on the bag, and that is the third out of the inning. Padres leave one. Score remains deadlocked at one. Popped up, foul territory behind the plate. Ball, ball, ball. McCann puts it away, and there's one down. Down and in. Very difficult to get on the same plane and do anything with. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Now two away. The wind and the pitch. Swing and a miss, and he is down on strikes for the third straight at bat. Three up, three down for San Diego. Still tied, 1-1. One, one. Back now, new pitcher on the mound as we roll into the bottom of the eighth. Hunter Green hasn't pitched in a while. He's had the last five days off. Your final score here today, 2-1. A one-run extra inning win for Chris Singleton and our entire crew. I'm John Chompy saying so long.